goal to reach the end of this section in just six days was going to push me physically. I had been on the trail for only two days and had traveled over 30 miles. Already the pain in my knees were getting the best of me. I was tired, hungry and in pain and was wondering if maybe my goals were a little bit too ambitious. Each step had me questioning my own resolve. But it was up to me, and only me, to complete the goals that I had set for myself. But doubt was beginning to creep into my will to succeed. Day four saw me awake to clear skies and I once again was awed by the sights I was privileged to experience. The beauty and majestic visions never grew old and I knew I would keep these memories for the rest of my life. These were the experiences I was looking for. Setting out, the trail was unsteady and rough, and along with the pain in my knees, the hike became more difficult. I had reached the goals along the way that I had set out for, but I would also be treated to something a little unexpected. From the trail, I arrived in the little German resort town of Helen, Georgia, just in time for St. Patrick's Day. Helen was a vision straight out of the Alps, and a great sight for sore knees. It was here I knew I could get a hot meal and a warm bed. They even provided the entertainment. back to the task at hand, hiking. Along the way, the trip would lead me to another hiker on the trail. Hey, uh, my name is John, through hiking the AT. Um, we're about Maybe a mile from the North Carolina border. Just kind of hanging out. Got to get to, uh, I think, Franklin in three days with very minimal food, so we'll see how that works. But yeah, been great so far. Weather's awesome. Sunday's going to get rainy, but it's been beautiful since, uh, since like, Wednesday. So. What's been your favorite part of the trip so far? Well, I think campfires have been my favorite and sleeping really well. I normally don't sleep very well at home because I drink far too much booze. So, <laughs> aside from that, yeah, I think just actually getting my heart up, getting my blood up. So have you gone into town any? I've been to Helen. That's pretty much it. We got our first uh, experience hitchhiking. That was really cool. Uh, it was a cool old timer in a red truck. Gave us a ride. No, no hesitation. It was great. 
But uh, yeah, that's that's been the only place we've been going was Helen and Neil's Gap, but that was you know right off the trail. So. Where are you trying to get to today? Oh man, you know I've forgotten the name of it, but it's about another 14 miles up the trail. Since we're uh, kind of running low on food, we're really gonna have to just bust some miles out. But uh, I think we can do it. After a short visit with John, it was back to the trail. At the end of the day, I would be completing another goal, the Georgia-North Carolina border. Okay, back in the tent. Uh, did day five today. Wasn't too bad. I um, only went about nine miles or so. Had a nice warm hotel room bed last night. And 